Hello again everybody and welcome back to the channel. Today we're back in the Fly by Wire A32NX for a really short video, um, less than a less than five, six minutes or so, to show you guys some of the new visual features that Microsoft Flight Simulator uh, now allow through the um, through the application of a visual studio editor. So heat blur and things like that can now be added to mods. And the Fly by Wire A32NX has now got one of those features. So Quickly into the flight deck here at Munich, Simwings Munich, really stunning bit of scenery. And we're going to fire up the APU. And uh, we're going to want to look at the APU exhaust. As it starts to spool up and fuel gets injected and it starts to heat up, you can then see heat blur. Which is a really cool feature and uh, brand new to Microsoft Flight Simulator as that brown guy is doing a moonwalk. Make sure you hit like and subscribe down below while you're here. And you're probably wondering why I'm doing a video based on heat blur itself. Um, that is because we can now add heat blur and a few other different visual effects on uh, all sorts of aeroplanes in different locations. Now, it's in its very basic form at the moment. However, over the next couple of months or weeks, if uh, Sobo and Microsoft uh, improve the SDK and the way this visual editor works, it will allow us to pinpoint, for example, we could pinpoint tire smoke onto each of the two tires at the rear so that when we touch down for a couple of seconds, we get a bit of smoke up here. Uh, so these are all things that we can look forward to in the very near future now that uh, Sobo have enabled these features. I think the fly-by-wire A32NX is the first aircraft to have a APU exhaust heat blur over time, they're going to try and link it so that uh, the heat blur outside the APU, for example, only comes on depending on what the outside air temperature is and uh, loads of other environmental factors too. Hope you enjoyed this very short video anyway. Really exciting because it does mean that in the near future we're going to be able to get things like tyre smoke uh, and things like that added onto aircraft. So certainly in my eyes are worthy of a little video to introduce you guys to this new feature at least at the moment on the Flyberwire A32 and X. So I hope you've enjoyed it. Give us a little thumbs up and make sure you've hit that subscribe button down below as well while you're here. Let me know what you think in the comments below and be sure to check out my live stream schedule and come and say hello when we're streaming next. In the meantime though, as always, thank you very much for watching and uh, see you soon.